Hello knitters, Barbara Benson here. I am an independent knitwear designer who also likes to make videos here on my YouTube channel, Watch Barbara Knit. Make sure to check in the description below where you will find links to anything I talk about in the video, including how to find my patterns so you can knit them up for yourself, how to join the Watch Barbara Knit Facebook group, and how to support me on Patreon. I have a fun announcement and a big discount today, but first I wanted to hit on something. I have absolutely no idea if this is like really visible um, on the video because I cannot see the screen. I can't, I mean, I can see that I have my little monitor in front of me, but I can't really see what's going on because I just had my annual eye appointment to get my eyes checked. There's nothing wrong with them, but you know, you do that thing and they dilated my eyes. <laughs> I can't see anything. So I am willing to wager that my eyes are like super dilated. There's nothing uh, nefarious going on here. I just had my eyes dilated so I could make sure they were nice and healthy. So if I seem a little unfocused, it's because I am a little unfocused. So the announcement that I have today, if you have been following for a little while, this is my third annual year doing this and I have to say happy Shalloween. <laughs> so Shalloween is a made up holiday. I made it up and I thought it would be fun in 2018 and I did it again last year and I had a lot of fun with it. So we're keeping it up. And what Shalloween is, is I go through my uh, library of independent knitting patterns. And this is specifically patterns that are available for single purchase. Um, so they're downloadable off the internet and I pick out five of them. And then I pick out one of the pictures from the pattern page and I hide a pumpkin in the photograph. Um, here is an example. This is obviously a cowl. Um, so it's not a shawl. I didn't want to give anything away because that would ruin the hunt of it. That would ruin the trick-or-treating part of it. But I wanted you to see what it would look like. The pumpkin, as you can see, is not particularly like hidden hidden. But the way it is hidden is that the pumpkins are not going to be visible in like the little preview squares. They're going to be hidden. So what you're going to have to do is go and look at all my shawl patterns. And it's definitely not gonna be in the top picture. I'm gonna tell you that right now because I don't wanna make it too easy. You know, this is trick or treat. So there's gotta be a little bit of a trick. And um, so you're gonna have to look at the pictures and look for the one that has the pumpkin in it. Five of my shawl patterns will have the pumpkin in it. And if you find the pumpkin in one of the photos, that pattern is 50% off for Halloween day only. So we're talking from uh, midnight on the 30th to midnight on the 31st uh, Eastern Standard Time. And there is a coupon code that you need to use. I'm going to put it up here. It is TREAT, T-R-E-A-T, 2020 trick or, you know, like trick or treat, treat 2020. You put that in where there's a place to use a coupon code and it will take 50% off of the shawl pattern. As I said, there are going to be five of them. So you're going to have to go poking around and looking for them. You can use the code as many times as you want. So don't worry about that. It's not like you have to get all five into your cart at the same time. You can look and come back and look, but the limitation is that it is only for Halloween because this is trick or treat. The trick is you got to look for them, but the treat is 50% off. So yay. Now, there is a tiny bit of a change from the last two years. Uh, for the last two years, it's only been on Ravelry. But now I have what is called a pay hip 
store. If you ever purchase a pattern directly from my website, it's going through a shopping cart system called Payhip, which means you're buying it directly from me and you'll receive an email with the PDF uh, attachment, I believe. I'm not real sure how that end of it works, but you'll get the PDF. It might be a download link. And so I have set up the trick-or-treating Shalloween event on both Ravelry and Payhip because I know that there has been a situation that has occurred that has made it so that Ravelry has some accessibility issues for some people and I wouldn't want those who are currently unable to use Ravelry because it induces migraines or whatever to, to not be able to participate. So I will put both links in the description notes. One will be to the Ravelry and one will be to the Payhip. You can use whichever one you want. The code is the same, TREAT2020, and the same five patterns are on sale on both platforms. So you don't, you're not missing out on anything if you use one or the other. It's the same. And, you know, I just thought it would be fun. Now, the links, the Ravelry link links directly to my Ravelry store. It is not my portfolio page because my portfolio page shows all of the patterns that I have available, which includes patterns that are in my book, patterns that are in magazines, patterns that are through third parties that are not, that you just, I don't want you to even worry about looking at those because there's no way they can be included. The Ravelry store is only patterns that are available for digital download through me. And those are the only ones that I have selected for the sale. The pay hip link does not go to my, um, does not go to directly to my personal website because it's not as easy to browse. I mean, you can browse my patterns, but there's no way to separate things out. It, it would load a lot and I wanted to make it as easy as possible. I mean, not as easy as possible. I, <laughs> I hit some stuff, but I wanted to make it easier. So the link is directly to the pay hip storefront where you can see all of my patterns. Um, it is not as slick as uh, my website, but it's easier. It should be faster for you to look through and bounce through. So that is the big exciting news. So you can get 50% off five different shawl patterns using the code TREAT2020 and happy Halloween! <laughs> or shall I cackle? <laughs> I can't fake laugh. So that was the big thing. But I also have one other thing that I wanted to mention. So a week or so ago, I went into a good yarn, Sarasota, which is where I work. And my boss, Susan said, there's a package here for you. And I was like, you know, that curious dog head tilt what do you mean there's a package for me? Who would send me a package at a good yarn? So I, I got it and in retrospect, I should have probably done like an unboxing on it, but I, I had no idea what it is. I didn't know who would send something to me at via courtesy of a good yarn. So it was this package and the return out uh, address simply says Paula and her last name, but I don't want to say that out loud because I don't know how she feels. And so I was like, what in the world is this? And I'm going to show you, I opened it up and look at this. <laughs> Isn't it absolutely adorable? And there was a note in here. Let me see if I can read it with my dilated eyes. Um, I'm <laughs> holding it way out there. It's not yellow, but I'm sure it's a tumped duck. Thanks for the videos, Paula. Paula G, I'm gonna say G. Thank you so much. The idea that you were out there and saw this someplace and thought of me 
it, I am, I am, I am flummoxed. I am flabbergasted and I am deeply, deeply thankful. Thank you so much for thinking about me. I'll put my logo up here. For those of you who don't know, my website is tumpedduck.com and my business name is Tumped Duck. And this is what my logo looks like. And this is definitely a Tumped Duck. He's so cute. And I will find a place for him over here on my, uh, Actually, I'm going to, I have a spot right here that I can put him for right now, but I don't know. I might have to rearrange. So that I wanted to say thank you so very much. He's so cute. So what's up with that? Now, I really, uh, your ingenuity of sending it to a good yarn is really impressive. I will mention that I do have a P.O. box. Um, if you are on my channel page and you click on the about, my information is there for when people were sending me postcards. So just FYI for future reference, I do have a P.O. box. I don't check it that frequently though. I need to get there because I'm pretty sure I have something in there that I need to pick up, but I haven't really been going to the post office much. But I wanted to thank you and, and let you know that I received it and it was received with the joy that I hope, hope it was sent with because it just made me smile and you could have knocked me over with a duck feather. So those were my two things for the video today. Make sure on October 31st on Halloween for, to go and hunt for your shawls celebrate Halloween with me if you um don't don't like give it away when you find them but you know watch I'll probably post about it on Instagram share it with your friends so that they can go and they can have fun and play the game with us as well so uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and are going to enjoy this little event if you like this video give it the thumbs up click that like button and if you would like to be notified whenever I upload a new video please subscribe to my channel and select notifications thank you so much